Welcome to the MTD CNC studios. I'm here with Scott from CG Tech. We're taking a bit of a journey into some of the functionalities within VeraCut. Now, one of those uh, is Reviewer. Now, if you do use Reviewer, you can see that it's very, very handy to actually double check what someone else may have programmed before you press the button on that machine tool. So Scott, could you tell us a little bit about how it works and how it benefits companies that are using VeraCut at present? Yeah, sure. So if we just look at the desktop, Mark, we've got Vericut itself as an application and we have Vericut Reviewer as a standalone application. The biggest difference is, is that Vericut is licensed. Okay, so you have to come to us to either subscribe to a license or buy a perpetual license. Vericut Reviewer is completely unlicensed, so you can have as many Vericut Reviewers installed around your business as you wish. The benefit being is that you have Vericut, I like to call it a little bit of a Vericut light, really, um, you can see everything that's going to take place on the machine tool from the same G code as always the machine tool runs um, before you actually go and run the part. So quite often you mentioned night shift mark. So let's say everyone's gone home, uh, the night shift comes in, uh, the machine stops and there's a new job scheduled to go on the machine. Now let's say that operator hasn't got sufficient information from the report um, or they're slightly nervous about what's going to take place um, within the actual machining process itself. Vericut Reviewer gives them all the tools to be able to visualize that process pre-machining uh, pre um, to give them in confidence. The last thing, uh, if you're running an engineering business or manufacturing business, you want is that machine to st stand idle all night because you had a slightly nervous operator. We've all been there before in machine tool shops where there's always one confident person that's working on one type of machine, but if they suddenly have to go onto another machine, I presume that's what it's there for as well. Yeah, it's to help them really, to give them some confidence. So um, just to explain that through, within Vericut itself, all we have to do is we can either launch reviewer from within Vericut itself. So we can say open review file, or we can save a review file as a separate file type so it's vc review opposed to vc project um, once we've done that we can just open reviewer it's a reviewer app runs on windows tablets so you so, can have so, it on a tablet oh right okay fantastic because it's a bit more flexible than just having a you know yeah, a desktop yeah. really isn't it yeah it runs on windows tablets um and again it's just like vericut really obviously you haven't got as many functions in in this piece of software but again, you just simulate through as you would. You just push play and we can see exactly what's going to take place um, on that machine. Such a fail safe, isn't it really? Yeah, yeah. One thing I really like about it, Mark, as well is you can just look tool, tool by tool. So if I come to tool here, I want to see everything that's going to take place between tool one to tool two. You just make a click and that's basically what tool one's going to machine. Okay, so... And, and, the, and the purpose of uh, this software, it's not just about this brand of machine tool or that work holding. It's, this is just for simulation only. This is just for demonstrative purposes, yes, Mark. It's not machine specific whatsoever. Um, it's just a function of the software. And, and when, you, when you sort of look at, uh, you, know, you know, proving the job out, um, I, I suppose at the end of the day, when you're changing materials, when, you, you, when you're using different machine tools, uh, you know, just double checking, it could yeah. cost you a spindle at the end of the day, couldn't it? 100%. So the operator might be given, a, we've just demonstrated reports, but what happens if the person that's programmed that job hasn't given that operator sufficient information? They can still come in here interrog and interrogate. So if I just say... I want to know what the distance is between the top of the stock and the top of the vice. So I can just come into X caliper and I can measure that. I can say, give me that distance using this tool here. So I could just say from a plane to another plane from here to here. Okay. I know that is now 150 mil. So they can go and set that job up sufficiently. That's the purpose of it. Now, it's interesting, actually, uh, when you look at this type of software, you know, you're not only saving tool life, you could be saving the, the spindle, as, as, as we said, because it, it does happen, unfortunately. But that's what Vericut is there for. And, and things like Reviewer is just that sort of comfort blanket that yeah. that job is going to go to plan. It's to install confidence around the shop floor pre-running a job. 
um, and to give them the information they need to be able to set the machine sufficiently. And I think it's a great benefit that if you do not have uh, you know, software to this capability like Vericut, this is why potentially you could consider that. And you're quite happy to actually do demos for, for new customers, aren't you, Scott? Always, always. We can come to site or during the times of COVID, we've done a lot of remote demonstrations, but you know, don't be nervous about getting in touch. You can get in touch. Um, we will happily visit your business and show you um, how it can benefit you.